On this trip, I was heading down to Ballinger, Texas, to the Salt Fork Ranch to take my first Texas deer with an air gun. But first, I stopped by Air Guns of Texas in Abilene to pick up my rifle and quickly check zero. That's what I like. <laughs> the target was at 50 yards, and outside the wind was pretty fierce. With the exception of one flyer, I was happy enough. I'd fine tune the rifle later. So I've got that, and then we tuned it up for your bullets. Which ones am I using? You're going to be using in the 357 our uh, 128 grade Devastator hollow points, field test proven, and in your 308 Air Force Texan, our 308 109 grain Stinger hollow points. Great. Can't wait to get out with them. I'm heading out now, and i got to run. I drove an hour and a half from Abilene to Ballinger and checked into one of the small motels. No frills, but it would do. Dumping my gear in the room, I drove to the ranch to look around. I was given a tour of the property and marked the blind I'd hunt the following morning. I got into the blind later than planned, but situated myself to see what would come along. As day broke, a group of does appeared to graze the corn I'd laid in the road, but I gave them a pass. Then a little buck came in, legal, but I didn't want to shoot yet. The morning slipped by, and eventually a flock of 20 or so turkeys moved in. Real Grandy turkeys group up in the winter, and toms, jakes, and hens are all legal. They moved towards the feeder, but then started to move away. Two jakes moved in and fed briefly, but I could tell they were getting ready to regroup. I took the shot, a bit further back than intended. The bird shot up in the air, but I saw him come down across the road. I'll be back for my deer by the end of the season, maybe another turkey. This is my first real grandy with an air gun, and I'm really pleased. <laughs>